Hey everybody, Justin Cener here. I've got a really great video for you today because I'm gonna teach you how to turn your Shopify store into an iOS and Android app. This is really cool and really valuable for any e-commerce store running on Shopify. And I'm gonna teach you step-by-step -step how to take your store and turn it into a iPhone app and an Android app and how to do it the right way with Shopify. And the reason that you want to do this is because brands that have apps see much higher sales, they see much higher revenue. And this is because iOS and Android apps increase engagement and they create loyal customers. When you have an app, right, you have a commitment from the customer. They want to have more interest in you. They're going to download your app and they're going to spend a lot more time than they might just on a website, right? They're going to browse through, they're going to have it on their phone available 24-7 and it's gonna create that really loyal customer that's gonna spend a lot more. And a really popular strategy right now is to use One Mobile to build an app for iOS and for Android for your Shopify store easily without any coding required. I'm gonna show you how it works. And if you wanna go ahead and implement this strategy, you might run into some pain points because there's no built-in way to do this with Shopify. You either need to hire very expensive iPhone and Android developers or use One Mobile, which is what I'm gonna show you in this video. And One Mobile is a really great app because it's super easy to use. It doesn't require any prior coding experience. And One Mobile makes it very, very easy to actually get your app submitted into the iOS and Google Play stores. You get to use their developer account. Makes it very easy. One of the biggest roadblocks that a lot of stores face when they want to get their app live. So that's what this video is all about. One Mobile. I highly recommend it. You see the link directly below this video. We're going to go over the shoulder. I'm going to show you a demo store. You're going to see just how easy this is to set up a really easy editor and you see the link directly below this video for the one mobile app i'm going to bring that over here right now and first thing i want to pay attention to built for shopify you see that diamond badge right there only a very few select shopify apps get that awarded by shopify basically it means the app is just does an incredible job at what it describes doing in this case building a mobile app for your store. And you see a near perfect 4.9 out of five star reviews on over 150 different reviews here. One mobile is going to easily allow you to build a mobile app. There's a drag and drop editor. So you're gonna be able to drive sales, increase retention, reduce ad costs, significantly boost up that customer loyalty and increase the uh, time that they spend with your brand with an iOS and Android app. And really I'm gonna go over the shoulder. You're gonna see you could build a mobile app in 30 minutes, really easy. Customize and launch it to your exact brand requirements and never have to do any code at all. That's really the best part. That's why One Mobile is so powerful. You're gonna be able to publish your app using One Mobile's developer account. I mentioned this before. Really one of the biggest roadblocks for people to actually get their app live. You get to do this in just literally one click over here with One Mobile, really one of my favorite features. And you get to choose from high converting themes. So you don't need to be an expert. You don't need to have any experience. You could pick from all these really high converting template driven themes here for your app. And it automatically pulls all the data, all the products directly from your Shopify store. Couldn't be any easier to have this intuitive drag and drop editor so you could easily customize exactly how everything's going to look. Color scheme, logos, layout, product, text, right? Everything so it matches your brand. And you have the boosted conversions on your app. You have that built-in one-click checkout with debit, credit cards, Apple Pay, Google Pay, right? You have the amazing checkout that comes with having a mobile app. You're going to have that built in here as well. Unlimited AI-powered push notifications. So you're always going to stay in front of your customers. So they're always going to be top of mind in terms of thinking about buying your product or re-engaging with your brand. And you have the QR code pop-up as well to get more users, right? Convert one-time users into lifetime app users. Get them to get the app on their phone. So you can push notification to them so you can get them engaging more and spending more. And of course, a lot of great analytics, real-time analytics that are going to give you the stats that you need to really make those data-driven decisions. So highly recommend it. Integrates with pretty much any tech stack that you're already using. Works with, uh, you know, that easy-to-handle submission process due to the fact that, uh, you know, they're using the developer accounts already built in with one mobile. It's just very, very powerful. It's really all about unleashing your sales potential with your own mobile app. And that's why One Mobile is going to allow you to do that. To get started, all you need to do, literally, just press the black install button right over here. Press install. This is going to bring you into your Shopify store where you'll go ahead and give permission 
for Shopify to go ahead and install the app. We're gonna go over the shoulder and I'll show you more. You're looking at the back end of One Mobile. Very, very easy to navigate back here. You see on the left-hand side, we have our menu. I'm gonna walk you through some of these things. App design, this is gonna be where we're actually customizing the look and feel of our uh, app. Really easy, we're gonna go over to customize. I'll show you that in a second. Push notifications, this is where we can easily create push notifications. Really, really powerful here. We could create manual where we send them whenever we want, or we could send automated ones, which are really powerful. For example, having an engaging message pushed over to new customers when they sign up or abandoned cart, inactive users, people who haven't opened the app in a long time, right? Lots of great ways. You, of course, do custom as well. Lots of great ways to send these push notifications. You could even add images to them as well. And you'll see that you'll be able to send them exactly where you want them to with all of the customizations you could ever want. App analytics, of course, going to be all of our stats. This is a relatively new app install here, so we're not seeing any data. Once you run this for a few weeks or months, you're going to get tons of different data. Another thing to call attention to, really like the monthly trends section over here. Again, once we get some data in here, you'll be able to start to see your monthly trends, which is really kind of the basis of how you're going to track how your app is. And of course, most importantly, sales. How much money did we make from the app? That's the most important thing. Integrations we have over here. You can integrate with a lot of different third-party apps. Really cool to kind of continue on all the features that you have in your storefront on your mobile app. Here is the pricing and uh, your kind of account set up here. Highly recommend the growth plan over here. You can save a lot if you do the yearly plan as well and you see exactly what you get, how many themes you get, the all the enhanced features over here for design. And you're going to see as I kind of walk you through that. I'm on the pro uh, professional plan. Highly recommend that as well if you really want to take your store to the next level. All of your settings will be right in here inside of the settings section. So without further ado, let's get into the actual editor. This is really cool because it's just like the Shopify online store editor where it's going to be basically point and click. I want to show you these over here. These are different themes that you can go ahead and implement inside of your app. We have the airy theme set up. And I'll show you how it looks on mobile in a second. It's really cool. You'll actually be able to preview this just like you would any other app on your phone. But we're going to click customize first. And this is going to bring us into that drag and drop editor. And the really cool part about this is you see everything that's going on here visually. So if you wanted to make a change to something, you just literally hover your mouse over. Let's say you don't like this section. You simply go to delete. And we have all these different blocks over here. They call block inventory. This is what we can add into our app. For example, an image title. So watch what happens. I'll take this, I'll drag this over into my app, and now I have this section. I come over here, and I could change the content. So here's the heading. I'll put uh, example content, and I'll put uh, whatever I want here, right? You can put in different information. You come over here. You could have images over here in terms of this left and right image, so we can go over here and add. Uh, a specific image if we wanted to and go ahead and do that. Really powerful to have all that set up uh, right inside here. I'm going to delete this one just because it's an example. And what we come, what we want to do is literally just come over here. You see maximum 30 blocks per design. So let's say we're on this home page. Let's say, uh, you know, we have the TikTok section over here. Maybe we don't want to show TikTok. We simply just delete it. All right. We can come over here. Maybe we want to show a circle image slider. Come over here and add that right there, right? We can have different maybe brand names here that we work with or different uh, buttons to signify different collections, right? We have the ability to have all of this right over here. And you see, we could literally have it go wherever we want. Send it to a different screen, send it to an external link, send it to a specific product, right? We come over here, select our product. So very, very easy to set everything up. I'll remove this one as well. Coming over here and you literally just have list after list after list in terms of what you want. And this is the really cool part about this. All of these blocks are available and they'll instantly start working inside of your app. So you don't need to worry about code, right? You want to add a video into your app? No problem. We just drag over the video. Come over here, but we put uh, happy customer testimonials. And then we could literally just copy and paste a YouTube link right over here. We even have full control over autoplay and looping, right? Muting the sound. So all of these features are really well thought out over here. And you can put 30 blocks per design. Let's go over to a product detail page now. Obviously, this is going to be very important in terms of uh, conversion, right? And we have all of the features that we could ever want here for a trustworthy product page 
inside of our app. You'll have the ability to change different things like image resizing, if you're gonna fill it, fit it, stretch it. Right now we'll have all these different actions in terms of being able to add things or remove things from our store. Maybe you don't wanna have the wish list. We could remove it. You see the heart goes away, right? We could do, turn it back on, it comes back, right? Sharing, of course, cart we wanna have on. Ratings and reviews, you don't want that, you simply turn it off. Product recommendations, you don't like that, turn it off. You have all of the controls right over here. Another cool thing, especially on apps, you'll see a lot of people browsing a lot of products. It makes a lot of sense to do something like this. Recently viewed products, right? So they can go ahead and see more. So when you like what you have kind of set up, you just save the page. You could do that for all of the different screens here. You got your search page. Of course, you got your cart page. You have your account page. Ability to reset all this. You want to move things around, no problem, right? We can literally just drag and drop. You'll see that things move. Very, very easy. You're never going to have to do anything technical. You're going to have full control over how your app looks and feels just by using this drag and drop editor. So remember to make sure you save all your changes. Coming over here. Here's what our home page looks like. I'm just going to come over here and uh, take a look. We have our different sections over here for our collections. We have our testimonials, right? All these different sections over here that we create. Create our promotion banner over here, right? And I'm just going to put uh, Justin did this, right? So we have all this in here, right? Now, when we're ready to go, we're going to click publish changes, okay? And we're going to publish our uh, app over here. Really easy to do. So we could preview this now on mobile. And I'm going to switch over to my phone now because we're going to actually be able to go ahead and in my phone, I'm using the One Mobile Preview app. It's a free app that One Mobile has created. And it allows you to basically test out your app before publishing it. So we're going to switch over to the phone. We're going to scan this barcode, barcode with the install with the uh, One Mobile app, which I already have installed. You can get it right over here. So preview. We're going to scan this barcode, and you're going to see just how this looks and feels on my phone. Now I'm inside of my phone, and uh, we're scanning that barcode. And you're going to see what's popping up here is our store. And this is the app. We have our uh, free gift pop-up that we've enabled over here. And now you see the different sections, just like we set them up inside of the design editor. You see that uh, Justin note in there that I put in there. Literally exactly as we saw inside of our Shopify app. Now we're seeing it in the app here in the App Store. This is on my iPhone, right? This is how it's going to look in your store. You see search, you see the products, you see the ability to showcase different products. You see, of course, product description and all the other different sections that you would imagine in a professional app. You now have access to that. And very, very simple when it comes to setting all this up. Really just spent a couple of seconds just loading a basic theme. You can go ahead and customize every single page, every single screen inside of this. You can customize the different integrations, like the pop-up that you're seeing. Really, really powerful. And this is all built in. So when you have add to cart functionality, you have the ability to have that one click checkout with Apple Pay or with Google Pay. Really, really cool. Really easy to do as well. And really the customizations are endless. All you need to do is just mess around in that editor like I was showing before. So that is the one mobile mobile app builder. Really powerful. Again, got that built for Shopify badge. Also want to show you something else. See, this is made by OneCommerce. They have the One Loyalty app. You actually saw this inside. This is an integration right inside of the One Mobile app that we uh, kind of tested and played around with on my phone. So really kind of cool thing that we have the ability to add in here. And this is an app also made by the uh, same developers. You see that perfect five out of five star review. Really easy to um, set up a loyalty program. Of course, it doesn't have to be used with the mobile app. It could just be part of your store. Really, really powerful. Of course, we know... Loyalty programs are great ways to increase sales, to increase customer retention, and to increase lifetime value. Basically, we're going to make more from our customers. And the more loyal they get, the more they should be rewarded. That's kind of the whole idea here. You're going to give them incentives to be rewarded. For example, you give them loyalty points every time they make a purchase. Or you give them loyalty points every time they you know, make an interaction and mention you on social media. Maybe they follow you on TikTok, uh, TikTok like your Facebook page. Right, they can get offers, they can get discounts. Um, the whole idea is that the more engaged they get, the more we're going to make off them in the long run. And even if we have to incentivize them with some things like loyalty points and rewards and discounts, it's going to be totally worth it. This app lets you do that very easily. Again, 
easy integration made by the exact same company. But uh, you see the links below. Highly recommend it. Make sure you jump in again. Built for Shopify so you know it is really the best of the best when it comes to turning your store into an iOS and Android mobile app. Check it out. Let me know what you build. I hope this helps you make some money, and I'll talk to you real soon.